Rail fence is a traditional quilt block made with strips of fabric. A traditional layout has it going in steps down the quilt. Today, I'm going to show you this simple rail fence quilt block. Welcome to Evita Studio. My name is Elizabeth and I help you make beautiful things with quilting, pojagi and embroidery. This rail fence block is a quick and easy block that can be used either with other blocks in a quilt or on its own. This block uses two different fabrics, so I'm using this pink fabric and this floral fabric. I'm going to show you how to do a 12 inch block, but you can check the link below for a tutorial that will include options for other sizes. From each fabric, cut a two and a half inch strip. Stitch the two strips together with a quarter inch seam allowance. Press the seam under the darker fabric. Double check the width of the strip set. It should be four and a half inches wide. From this, cut four and a half inch pieces. You will need nine of these pieces for each block. Lay out these pieces in a three by three layout. The pieces are arranged so that the color step down the block. Join the pieces into rows, then join the rows together, just like a traditional nine patch block. There it is, a simple rail fence block. It should be 12 and a half inches square. One thing to notice with this block, if you're going to make a quilt with just this block and no sashing or anything in between them, then you're going to want two different layouts. If all your blocks are identical, you're not going to have that stepping design going down the quilt. So you're going to want alternate blocks. The alternate blocks are made with just the same pieces, just some of the pieces are turned in a different orientation and that way you can have that stepping design going all the way across your whole quilt. There it is, a simple and easy rail fence quilt block. This block is super easy to adjust to different numbers of fabrics in different sizes. So be sure to check out my other video on how to do rail fence quilts in any size. Also, get my rail fence workbook. This workbook has tutorial for doing the block in different sizes, has inspiration for layouts of rail fence quilts, and coloring pages so that you can design your own with whatever you have on hand. For more information, tutorials, and inspiration, check out my website, ebitastudio.com.